What's going on YouTube? Episode 26 Ticket Survival Series AKA Ticket Madness Series That's it, that's that's the name of it I'm, I'm just going to stick with that That came up with one then, that came up with one But anyway Episode 26 Previous episode We have built the quarry Steam engines, got all the shit together, landmarks, we are good to go, we are building this quarry, now. Okay, <laughs> right, um, thing is, where am I going to build it? Because I want to build it over water, so, because if you think about it as well, if, because I was telling you about information on the quarry, it can mine through water but it can't mine through lava so if think about it this way if you drill over water as it goes through water will hit lava make obsidian drill mine obsidian everybody's a winner so I'm gonna be going with that to well now but first things first I'm actually gonna make I could why can I see so clear underwater? What the hell? Look at that, I can see so clear. But I am going to build my quarry quite big as well. I'm going to build it probably about 10 by 10. Just for my first quarry. I know you guys would be like, oh no, do it by 64 by 64. Yeah, good luck trying to mark that out. So put a landmark on there, like here. So you go one, two, three. One, two. It's hard to mark underwater. One, two, three, four. I can't even see where I'm marking. Well, um, this is the part where I need dirt blocks of some sort, or I can just go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So 10 will be here. Like that, so that's 10. Um, might go for 20 by 20 actually because that's relatively small. <laughs> and I did bring a pickaxe. Oh yeah, look. What a bean. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yeah, we've got twenty by twenty. Yeah, that. Yeah, that's spot on. Spot on. Hit the spot, wolf. Right. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Oh shit. What a fucking stupid ass water. Oh my god. Right. Must count. Oh great. Um, wait, I'll go away. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So we want to build on that one there. And the best part about it is I've already got three landmarks marked out. So right click on that, it will take me to that one show that I'm lined up click that one boom so what we've got to do is go over to this corner here plant a landmark and then I've got our pick a whatever side I want to put the quarry on so landmark right click that as well just to be sure I don't know why that just went off then oh no don't tell me we've had problems Oh no, we have problems. 
Oh no. What is going on? Oh no, please don't tell me we've got problems. What the f Do you know what? I'm just going to destroy the landmarks and replant them because I do not know what the hell is going on right now. Please don't make me resort into making it a standard size quarry because that's going to be crap. Wait, whoa. Free. Come on, we can do this. Four. Right click that, and there we go. Get the quarry. Boom. There we go. There we go. Then all you have to do is pick up your landmarks, obviously. You'll always have that one odd landmark as well that would like to stick on the corner. So always go around, check all your corners, and then destroy that one landmark that likes to just jam there with the frame. Like it's just there, uh, trying to blend in. But no. Nah. nah. i got to take you back soon. So, just swim, fly, whatever, to your destination. I've actually done a tutorial on this, on how to build your own size quarry. So, yeah, be sure to check that out, guys, if you want to, like, run, well, if you want to know how to make it full detail. Because I, I actually do go into full detail on how to build it. So what you want to do is you want to get a steam engine, steam engine, and you want to get one underneath as well. But to get the one underneath, obviously we need to put water around it so I can put the levers down. So, like so, steam engine there. We'll do that, 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 and that. Like so. I might do it actually, yeah, because like that, like that. Get the two levers down, like so. Turn them on. And then, well, now that that's on, what you want to do is you want to get, you won't need a wooden transport pipe actually, stone, and then cobblestone or stone, whatever, bring that out, you want to make a nice little platform for all your chests, so I'm going to do a... Gonna need way more chests than this, but this is just to start off with. Because a good thing about a quarry is while it actually digs down to bedrock. So yeah, you can't really go wrong about quarries. I wanna line it up, I'm picky about this. Looks better and neater if it lines up. I'm 
missing two chests there's the last one plus I've got pickaxes to waste I've still got like how much materials left so yeah I'm not really bothered if I have to replant them so chests like so double chests you get the transport point what I might do is I might put a gold one in there gold and then iron and then we'll put and now what you want to do with iron transport pipes they're they're like the one way they're one way pipes sort of thing wherever the solid grey block look alike like that one's on this side the blocks will be blocked from going that side so you want to have a wrench or something right click it and it will swap it like so what you want is so it blocks the blocks going from that side to that side so say when they we sh these chests full up uh, full up fill up they'll go back up hit that block but they'll come back and they'll just keep on doing that until I put more chests down so that's one good reason why you should always have a uh, transport pipe there also you need a redstone torch for to power the golden transport point but me being me I didn't bring one so yeah I kind of failed on that part but apart from that we're all ready to go with the chests just gotta hook them up now like so put the ah oh, just realised as well I need to be able to get access to that where's that coal gone well I need to split that Wait, what, what am I doing? One, two, three. So that steam engine gets four. That steam engine gets four. And that steam engine gets four. Now, they will start building the frame, as you will see in a sec. You could have a steam engine there as well, but I don't like doing that because you need to gain access to all. But. Oh, it's building the frame relatively quick, actually. Good thing about steam engines as well. Well, good thing about quarries as well. Everything that's in the middle, lily pads, that tree, that will all be cleared out. And I think it actually collects the materials as well. But what I'm going to do is I need to go back to the house. There's no mobs out. Why aren't there no mobs out? Is it having one of these phases again where no, no mobs come out and then suddenly they come out of nowhere and, and kill me? They're all planning something. God knows. Um, I don't get how that coal gets there though. It's really spooky. Spooky ghost. But gotta go down here. Gotta get one piece of redstone so I'll get there. Transport point. One piece. Just plenty. Exo. What I'll eventually do as well is get a filter so it will actually filter out all the objects in different types of chests as well. As you can see, it's actually clearing out the tree in the middle, which is actually really good because that I, I do love that about these type of quarries. Um, 
So I've got to divide this by four. All three, not four. How many how many pieces of coal did I originally put in it? It doesn't burn through coal that quick, does it? Oh damn it does as well. Might get lava buckets son. Slava buckets, they they're good. They they real good. What's it doing now? Is it still clearing out that tree? Yeah, it's still clearing out the tree and building the frame at the same time. That's why it's going slow because it's clearing out the stuff in the middle. I don't get a new fit. But now that's shot across. Yeah, not not shooting across. But as soon as you see the frame complete and everything's cleared, you see a big blue drill come down. Which is actually really cool. Cool looking blue drill. And you can actually walk through it as well. It don't do any harm to you, so that's another funny thing about this. There's that odd block, just tree block. There we go. There's the drill, and off it goes. Oh, it's going to that block to get it. Look, I'm gonna have that block now. Bloop, pop. There it is. Now that going, that will go into one of the chests, and I'll have that block. Oh, got two free pieces of dirt as well for it now. But once these get up to speed as well, that will make the steam engine go a lot faster. Well, it's steam engine. Well, once these go orange, well, yeah, they go green first which is optimum and then they go orange red which means maximum speed but they I don't know whether steam engines blow up but machines on like minecraft blow up oh that reminds me Dominic actually commented saying I, I still ain't looked at your comment Dominic sorry about that mate um, but you said they have a one machine has a habit of blowing up, so I need to check that out so I don't end up using that machine because I'm a common idiot for using that machine. Well, I probably would. So I'll have a look at what you were saying, mate. But yeah, guys, that is episode 26 of my tickets. Well, ticket madness series. I need to get in the habit of saying that because that is the name for it now because no other uh, that that is the official name nobody's taking that name now it's mine but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed it uh you've learned a lesson as well as i did how to build a quarry machine 20 by 20 blocks um i hope you enjoyed it comment like subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next episode see you there